Hello digital video camera. I thought today would be a good day to kind of recap just what happened this past week. So I completed the third week of my 12 week program. Technically, I'm doing it again. Last week, I ran the same exact week, but come Friday, I kind of broke down. I missed my lifts, the primary lifts. And so Friday, Saturday, I didn't get my lifts in. And I wasn't happy with that. I was quite disappointed, so I decided to run this week back. You know, exact same schedule, just do it again, see how everything feels, actually, you know, get the stuff done this time. And it went quite well. I'll say that. It went quite well. I could have improved in many, 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 many areas, but I won't nitpick. I'm just going to go over what happened. The first adjustment I made was Monday. No more weighted pull-ups. So I did some pull-ups on Monday. I don't think I even hit my, my goal, but I'm just going to be doing regular body weight. It's pretty hard to recover from AMRAP squat on Friday, followed by heavy deadlifts Saturday. You know, I get Sunday off and then Monday doing weighted pull-ups again was just way too draining. So Monday is kind of like another recovery day for me at this point. Like I don't really have a primary focus. I'm just doing some movements that will, you know, overall it will help me, but I'm not going to be progressively overloading anything. There's nothing big scheduled. So that's change number one. Tuesday went pretty much exactly the same. I hit three sets of five with 225 pounds. I did that again. So this week I felt a little better than last week doing it. It didn't take me as much time. And what else can I say really? Wednesday is overhead press, which <clears throat> this one's kind of tricky. This is another adjustment I made. So it's actually strict press, right? So I'm not supposed to be using my legs or my hips, but I decided I'm going to do as many overhead presses as I can each week. I've got a goal number I want to hit. You know, this week was three sets of seven. And then once I get those, I do overhead presses. So until I'm basically worn out because the strict press, once you fail a rep, it's very unlikely that you're going to be able to break that, you know, that static force and actually get the weight up once you fail. From my experience, once you're out, you just, you just won't be able to get that weight up. But with the assistance of my hips and my legs, I can definitely get it up. So that's gonna be the second change is on Wednesdays when I do my strict press. Once I'm out, I'm gonna keep going for some more reps because I can still work my arms and my shoulders, it's just, the strict press kind of limits me in that regard. And that's all right. I found a way around it. So I'm going to try to do this. Uh, maybe not every time. If I hit my numbers, maybe I'm just satisfied with it. But we'll see. Now, Thursdays are, once again, weighted pull-ups. I actually didn't do them this week. So didn't do those. Uh, I just did some squats, some light exercise, and I didn't do the weighted pull-ups. Friday was my AMRAP with 225s. That was very good. Very, very good, actually. I got 11 reps with 225 compared to last week when I didn't even get to 225. I got to 205. I did six reps and I quit. I just couldn't do it. I was not in it that day. And, you know, it shows by the results. But this week, I let myself recover a bit better. I didn't do some, you know, really heavy rucking right before I'm supposed to squat heavy. So that definitely, definitely was not a uh, help last week. But, you know, I got it done. I did a lot better. I got a three rep PR and I'm happy with that. Saturday was once again successful. 
Uh, actually, not once again. This is the first time I've done a set of five with 245 pounds deadlift. So Saturday was just a success. Yeah, that was just good. I mean, one thing that I will mention... Actually, let me finish going over this. Sunday, you know, got my stuff done. It's my recovery day, so really no primary lift just kind of going through the motions as you can see i'm doing a whole bunch of stuff adductor stretches some body weight squats some l-sit pull-ups or chin-ups and that's it now what i wanted to say was i'm missing a lot of these lifts in my program i'm missing a lot of them like half pretty consistently and that's not where i want to be at i'd like to be hitting them a lot more often I'm not going to be changing the program at all. I'm going to move forward into week four just the way I planned it. Maybe I'll make a video on that tomorrow, like how week four is going to look. But, you know, yeah, that, that is a good idea. I probably will do that. I just don't like the fact that I'm missing a lot of these movements. Forearms, you know, biceps, triceps, uh, tibialis. You know, I'm missing a lot of stuff that I really could get done. And, you know, it's all right for now. I'm still pretty new to this programming thing. I mean, I've been doing it for a month, so I should be getting a grip by now. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's going pretty well. It's just I could be doing more lifts. The primary lifts are getting better. And very soon I will be upping the weight. Overall, solid week. I mean, yeah, I'd, I'd like to go into all the things that I could have, should have done, but I don't see the point in, you know, soaking in that. I'd rather just move forward, make week four a solid week, and keep going with this program. I'm almost a third of the way done, and I've made a lot of progress so far. I'm feeling good. Thank you for watching. I'll be back with some more squats tomorrow.